welcome to my channel today is something i'm really excited about it is of the evelina de moray and we refill its handbag and i have wanted this bag since i saw it like back in 2017 or something when they started doing the pre-sales so i am very excited to finally have it in my hands i was lucky enough to win some store credit to Evelina's store. Uh, she had like a little competition on her Instagram and this is the first time I ever win anything so I was very happy and it's kind of my Mother's Day gift. Okay so I'm already in love with just the dust bag. Look at how look at how gorgeous the embroidery on this is. No I'm, I'm used to dust bags being nice but this is just gorgeous but let's uh look further into it so so the back is vegan leather and it feels like some sort of velvet or corduroy i think velvet what really drew me to the back is that it's black and purple which is kind of my favorite combination i really like how sturdy it feels it doesn't feel like flimsy cheap material um we also have the beautiful tag here so this is the front of the bag the gorgeous tribal looking and then it has kind of little rhinestones and kind of scalloped edges and it starts with a nice zipper on the back and let's open it up and we have it comes with a strap the strap is also with the same little beautiful stones. It doesn't look like it can be adjusted, but it also looks to be a fairly nice normal length. So starting with the mirror. I like that it has a mirror. I don't know if any of my other bags have that. I don't think I've seen it. And it's this gorgeous velvet on the inside too and it has three compartments one compartment has a zipper and then the two on the each side of it are not so i really like that feature i i feel my really prefer if my bags have one zippered uh compartment just so, so things that i'm a little more nervous about falling out and it closes with like a snap button thing so i i'm mean, kind of Surprised about the size. I thought it was going to be a little smaller, but I actually really like that it's a bit bigger because I always feel I never have enough space. So that is definitely a plus for me. Look that it can stand if you want it to. Another thing I really like that I've noticed is that the thing that the strap attaches to, it can kind of go on the inside. So if you don't want to wear it as a over the shoulder, but just have it as a clutch, the things don't poke out and look ugly. And I kind of like that because sometimes if they're like really big, it just looks like you lost the strap. So, so I appreciate that feature. So yeah, I really like the sturdiness and it is, it is beautifully made, beautifully designed. I can, can't wait to like style this. like with the strap on it is a nice length for me i don't think it can go cross back body well it actually i was wrong it i guess it depends on how you want it but in a pinch for me it would be fine to wear a cross body i do like that option especially if the kids quickly need me or something i like having that option so the chain is metal here and it feels the same um, vegan leather material as the rest of the bag. I appreciate very much that it is silver and not gold because I personally love purple and silver together. That's how my mom used to decorate always. So I feel it's just beautiful mixture if you look at these here. It just plays really well on each other. So gorgeous, the detailing. but. Wow, I am so impressed with the beauty of this bag and I feel so lucky that I won this so I could get it. I do think she has a few more left, but I think that it's kind of, 
not a lot more when i think when i ordered mine they were like 20 or something left so if you want one you should probably hurry i have no idea if they're gonna restock or anything but i just love my bag and i feel you'll be seeing a lot if you uh like follow me on instagram or something so yeah i am um, i obviously can't speak on how it holds up but so far, um, I'm very impressed with it. And I would definitely want to purchase from her again. She does have a lot of really nice things. But this one I had just been wanting for so long. So that's the one I went with. I'll be sure to get some close up because it's a little hard to show it all this way. But I love it. So yeah, if uh, if you own this bag or um, or you just thought of buying it, comment down below what you think. And thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And until next time, bye.